Hi, welcome uh, to this community. Welcome back. Welcome if you're new. Uh, I'm going to do tower love reading on your person because you want to know what's going on with the divine masculine, right? Uh, what comes up about you, I'll, I'll touch on as well. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to jump straight in. So what I was picking up whilst I was meditating, whatever, on the cards. Um, there's something new. Um, so it's like the world card. So there was a wake up call to something. I'm getting it's quite painful. Ten of swords, three of swords. So something that you thought was going to work out hasn't worked out. Something like that. It's extremely painful. But with me visualizing, well, it's not actually. Yes, yeah, all right. That's degrading, connecting to the Andromedans. With me getting my downloads, which isn't downloads anyway. It's connected with the world card. So this was uh, divine. This was about how to live on this planet that you have to. Uh, they're saying you knew. You knew there was something wrong um, with a connection. And you just hoped. And it's the, the thing with the twin flame. Let's talk about connection is that you hear a lot about the mirror. And the mirror is with your person, let's talk about your person, is that they know what they're doing with the third party. Third party could be baby's mum, baby's dad, religion, tradition, work, whatever, friends, whatever. They need to step up because what I'm getting is the fall, taking that leap of faith. There's an ending world card for a new beginning to jump into something Um and same with you, you knew, you know, with your person, it's just not right or something's not right, but you need to take the leap of faith and do something yourself. So that that's the mirror here. The, the reason why I feel it's between, you're in between, in between, and that's a horrible place to be, the in between, but you're in between the world and the fall, which although they are massively important, all cards are important, major, minor, no, they're all important, right? But uh, I would just say, obviously, the major ones are universal upstairs, which most people don't use on this planet, but they're all relevant. My point is back to relativity. So you're connecting with inside energy. I'm feeling like that. No, they're saying actually energetic, your intuition you need to listen to right you're not listening to that but anyway between the two worlds of the fall and the uh the um the world card it's like the reason why you're not leaping in taking that jump taking that and this is your person as well although you know you have an inner feeling that it's new it's exciting it's um it's for you to take that leap of faith the full card means leaving things behind. Um, and that's what you don't want to close out that old cycle. Um, you and your person, there's a cycle that they struggling with closing out. Same with you. Like you might be, I feel with your person, like I said, it's to do with third party. With you, your third party, generally the divine feminines know that they need to be healing right and but their healing is a crystal acupuncture yoga meditation which is doesn't do i'll just say nothing right i was going to say enough they corrected i'm going with what they say nothing it doesn't right it's momentarily it's like you know it doesn't it's it's not beneficial for you and this isn't to dis disrespect anybody it's the truth and that's what high priestess is following the your truth of your, well, the fool's journey anyway. So this is about you, like you could be in the 3D job and you don't want to be there, right? You're not following your, this, mainly that's what this is. And you think that it's to do with spirituality, yoga, meditation. No, the, the high priestess and the, uh, and the fool is tarot. You're connected to tarot, hence why you watch so much tarot readers, because you're the high priestess. But the high priestess, is in between worlds right and you're in this in between at this moment and she has the veil of illusion between the 3d and upstairs i'm not going to say 5d because it's not 5d it's upstairs everything that is upstairs is 5d but it limits it from the actual words of what 
people say to 5D, you think it's just 3D, planet Earth and heaven. There's multiverses of reality upstairs. And upstairs is classed as 5D. I've got to make that clear. There's only one 3D, planet Earth, but there's multiverses of reality on 5D. It's not just one 5D. Anyway, back to you two. So you're in this in between. Your person's in this in between because you don't want to take the leap of faith. The other thing that I'm picking up with the energetic frequency of the before I jump into the cards, it's that you know it's going to be long. You're used to something, doing something now, the easier, the pussier option, pussy option, I'm just saying. I've been there, I've done it myself. The new option, although it will transform your life, that you know the end goal, you're going to be happy, financially abundant. You know that it's like, mm, it's like as if upstairs, for example, is saying to you, say you want to be a singer. And you're getting the intuition like, listen, this is your time now. World card, right? Universe. You in reverse, connecting upstairs. This is your time. You're just, you don't know. You just got this thing as this is your time. This is the divine feminines. You, if you now start doing your singing properly, taking singing lessons, um, stop singing in pubs, start going to proper auditions, find out how to be in auditions, start being more healthy, drinking loads more water, exercising your throat, exercising, you know, that's that long journey. But you have this kind of inner knowing that, fuck, if I do it, I know, I'm I just know I'm going to be successful. There's something that's come into you that you know is going to be successful. But it's a world card. It's a circular. The fall is circular. It's a zero point. So when it's circular, it can go back. It can go forward. So you're at this in between. Should I go back to the comfort zone of the shit? But you know that shit will be forever. Or should you move forward into the new direction? It's risky. I've never done anything like this before. It's still a long road to go. But it's kind of like, you know, along that way, you're going to get, I wonder, if, I thought, did you hear the confirmation? But, Sigan, is it my son? <clears throat> no, because he normally does two or three at the same time. Anyway, <clears throat> I'll leave it. Oh, it's there, my phone. <laughs> anyway, um, you know that along the way, you're going to get little bits of success, little bit of success. Well, they said you don't know, but you will. If you take the leap of faith, even though it's a long way, because the zero point of the fool's journey, you have to go through all these star signs, hence you are all star signs. I don't know why they say sun, moon, rising. I'm like, stop that. Please stop that, right? You go through all, is that all there is? Sun, moon, rising, upstairs, like I said, uh, this, this community tells you the truth. That's just a platform of upstairs, right? It's not just 5D, <laughs> right? But you're all so the fool goes through all starting with Aries, all the foot star signs. So you trade you take traits of the positive of all star signs, including the negative, so that you can go towards the positive, because all cards have negative and positive, hence the polarity of this planet. So you start with Aries, like I said, a new cycle to jump in, but you're getting a bit confused we're not confused about well you're like i don't know should i go back i feel you're pulled towards going forward but i'm not sure what you're gonna do what are you gonna do peeps mm. i'll tell you what you do you follow your intuition you can't go wrong this planet is condensed it's the lowest planet you know 3d and then you go all the out earth air water fire right you go upwards with the lowest energetic frequency, it's condensed, it's negative, upstairs, positive, as above, so below, we get the, so upstairs, you connect upstairs, is perfect, and you connect intuition, intuition, tuition, 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 it's teaching you, you hear that, tuition is teaching you, follow that, feel that it's connected with your person as well, but like I said, I think you're both in this, I don't know what to do, I feel your person might be, mm, let's go into what's going on with your person, shall we? Because I know that's what you want to hear. One more. Check out the Facebook and all the good stuff. You get loads of programs in there. If you just got onto the Facebook, scroll down, you get all the programs, you get all the quotes. Because all I do is keep, 
well, well, I repeat things, but there's tons of stuff. You might go in there and say she's not posting there. There's not a lot of things apart from you get everyone on this community posting additional reads in there. Now you go down, there's loads of stuff you learn about this journey of you. Do you understand how important you are? Ooh, and that's the truth. I know people don't like it when I say it. Um, crystals, yoga, acupuncture, breathing in the fresh air, hugging a tree. Now, you go outside breathing fresh air, yeah, it's fucking good. Momentarily, hey, right? Momentarily. Doing yoga and stretching and all that, yeah, helps your body. But the truth is, you are more than that. This isn't disrespect. This is me saying you're limiting yourself, mate. <clears throat> oh, there's a holding back, both of you. It's interesting because the four of pentacles I'm getting here is got a woman, right? But I feel this is both of you holding back to take that leap of faith, like I said. And your person holds back and they think it's strong, it's masculine, but it's actually with the woman. I don't know how to say this, but it's come to me. It's like, no, you're being a pussy. You're being a woman because a woman's known as a pussy. Oh, it sounds crude, but I'm just saying. You know, you're not going for really what you want to do. That's what I'm getting. So you're both holding back on your wishes, on your desires. Your masculine's holding back to go towards their uh, their uh, person with the woman. It's like um, to do that takes strength. To go and tell your friends, your family, the exes, the, uh, to get a divorce, the babies, my baby dies, you, you're worth someone. That is strength, not what you're doing, juggling a million hours and, and all this kind of thing. That's not strength, right? So it's like they feel the strength from that, your person, to like, if I manage you over here and that other world of my family and my kids over here, then I make a perfect foundation with the four of pentacles as main cards. I haven't even looked at the others yet. Well, I picked up and it's like, no, that, how's that been in your feminine? And they think by coming to you and being nice, right, is them giving to you. Now, giving is like, what do you really want? And seeing what you really want, this is about delusions as well. Just, I, I never forget, and it's connected. I, I spoke to, I'm never going to do it again. I spoke to a neighbour. I don't know. Uh, yeah, she's just started waffling off. And I said to her, what do you want to do in life? Now, we were talking about relationships. And she was like, oh, do you know what? I'm a good person. And uh, I'm just going to meet that person in that divine time when it comes in. But I'm never going to talk to people again. <laughs> I've talked to one person today. That's enough. Thank you very much. I'm never talking to people again. I'm quite happy connected to them lot upstairs. Thank you very much, right? What nonsense. <laughs> what nonsense. How the fuck? Someone's just going to randomly come up to you on the street. Well, why haven't they done that already? You have to get out there, right? And you attract who you are, right? <laughs> All that was going through my head. I was biting my tongue, literally not to get into the conversation. I think that was two years ago, same shit with her. Single was what I mean. And that's the b bad thing about, it, it's like, like I said, your deluded perception, this is Divine Feminine, is you that are watching, I apologise, but like, so you go to listen to someone else, but hear me out on this, please, please. You think that you are just to do spirituality in your program of spirituality, crystals, yoga, acupuncture, meditation. No, that spirituality is simply to connect upstairs with your intuition. Because if you if you doubt that, right, you doubt that, you then now ask them now, is it crystals? Is it acupuncture? Is it hugging a tree? Or am I more than that? And if you say you connected, well, no, because you're not delusional. I was going to say you can email me. You can put it in the comments. And you say they said, no, it's just a crystal. I'm like, no, you lost the plot, mate. But they will tell you, no, it's bigger than that. 
is connecting upstairs. And that's what you're here to bridge both worlds, right? 3D, 5D. And that's what this is. So like I said, the truth is you're limiting yourself. You're holding back. You're not being your true. The Empress is uh, <clears throat> nurturing to yourself. Mother nature, right? Yeah, it's connecting with mother nature, but it's not in the, the bullshit 3D way that you are doing it. So interesting, my art is becoming more of my um, spirituality self. I'm talking more about what I'm talking about on this channel. I'm, I'm, it's not just expressing it through art. I'm actually putting it in the art about how I'm talking here on this, in, on this channel. And that's what you lot aren't doing. You're not being humanitarians talking about what I'm talking about, which you want to talk about, which you only do that when you connect inside. I didn't read a book. I haven't read about humanitarian. I haven't really read about this stuff. The only person I kind of followed was David Icke. And then I got into Mark Passio and other things and etc. You just follow. Well, my sister got me into all of that. Like I said, there's 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 traits that you're you're holding back on. And the Empress, Empress, Empress. Okay, let's jump into uh, this. So, Ace of Swords. Yeah, it's clarity about your truth. And the truth, mm, is that coming in? I think it is coming into you now. Ah, the world. Yeah, because it's a new year coming up soon. It's coming, what's the date? 20th, it's a new year, right? Not, not bullshit. 3D New Year, new cycle, new year of this planet is coming up soon. So it's trying to get you onto your truth, right? Into clarity, into your truth, into clear mental thinking, into cutting out shit, right? Into you getting into your masculine. This is, um, like I said, with this, with the woman, this is about the masculine, your person also, getting more into the feminine which is actually if your person does express right which is very rare but they may do that's not enough them being in their feminine is marrying that person living with that person talking about that person hence as i was saying correctly that your skewed perception and i know i piss off people and i know people are hating on me probably doing all hexes and shit on me right Anyway, my point is, is that if they're saying my person, they are holding themselves back as well. This isn't about cussing out twin flames who say my person because I say David. It's fuck all to do with that. It's to do with why do they feel to hold back? You should blatantly be proud. I'm proud of David. I'm proud that I worked on... Um, uh, um, uh, myself from being with David and saying his name and if he came to me and said what you say my name on YouTube for red flags right they are not proud to say that person's name they are not following the red flags it's simple that's what I'm saying this planet overcomplicates it it's like who made up this my person oh it's a way of saying you're with your twin flame but you ain't really holding back, such as them, you're mirroring them, they hold back, they don't speak, speaking, right, they don't go and talk about you to their loved ones, they're not being in their masculine with the masculine hand, and you're not talking proudly about this, it's not even proudly, but on your channel, this, this delusion of my person, my person, no, say their fucking name, why aren't you saying their name, like I said, this isn't about me intentionally um cussing out twin flames but it's for them to wake up to the truth so they are are they really they're lying to themselves then right that's what i'm saying empress is not they're not nurturing themselves that's what this is this is about nurturing yourself on the 3d as well this is not obviously about me disrespect dis dissing you from the 3d I'm saying that, yeah, nurture yourself the 3D way and you connect upstairs as well. That's what your inner child wants. 3D, 5D. As your child, pretty much a lot of you were, I can't remember the name. What's the name? I can't remember. Anyway, were you, 
you might have been a child by yourself or done things quite individually for yourself and you feel connected with angels and all that kind of thing, right? That nurtures your inner child. What happened to that? Sorry, side note. What have we got here? Car crash. Why am I getting that? Oh, this is, ooh. Hold on. We got, which one's first? Eight of Wands, Two of Wands. Ah, yeah. Five of Cups. I knew this felt negative. The top row, it's like knowing, like I said, they don't... Ah. And I know it sounds like I'm um, up my ass or vain or dissing people, but they don't know tarot. And they're always saying they know tarot. No, you don't. Knowing the definition of a card in reversal is not knowing tarot. Tarot is universal laws. They don't know laws. They don't know energy. But they speak of it. This is just speaking, right? It's knowing truth as well. And why I'm saying that? Because they would know about quantum physics, energy. You can't just say this energy, sun, moon, rising. You would know that, hold on, it's upstairs. There's more than just one upstairs. You know that there's more entities upstairs. You can connect with cats, dogs. You can connect with multiverses of reality. When I first started on this channel, I was connecting with, oh, okay, tricksters and dominants. I didn't want to know to see, and I still really don't want to know what they look like because I'm not used to it and it's a bit scary for me. I'm a bit of a pussy. I can't do horror movies. I don't like pain. I'm quite strong and quite, people see me as tough, but I'm a pussy with horror movies and all that scary stuff. So what they've done is they connected me with, half a human face she was half a, a human and uh, eleanor eleanor was the human name they gave her and the rest of her was reptilian <laughs> i was like couldn't you even make the bottom reptilian now she gone i just connect straight to the andromedans who are in the film i can't remember my point is is that they're all different forms it's not just god like it's not just that. And that's what this is. The truth is connecting upstairs, right? Because Eight of Wands is Cupid love arrows on this planet. They're pointing down to you on this planet, right? And it's it's eight. So you, you can love your person. You can love. It's teaching you from upstairs of how to love variations of love. Like you just want your person. It's like you're loving your kids. This is oh, so much I'm getting. This is about how you treat your kids as well. My son, I never showed him tarot. I never showed him how to be an entrepreneur. I never really showed him how to clean or cook, especially cook. I'm sure David can definitely highlight that because I don't really like cooking. All that kind of thing. He's independent. He's an entrepreneur. He loves doing tarot. His place is spotless and he's clean and tidy. You in 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 intuition influence your kids so you can chat all you like with the ace of swords the cupid love arrows is telling you eight of wands that they will watch you and they will be like well yeah i might go for all my love person this is both of you right this is both of you here this is negative and positive i might want my person but my, my dad, my, my, my dad, I go to both of you because my dad didn't go towards the love, right? He just worked a million hours. So all their sons was going to do is work a million hours and be as unhappy as your person is because they're not going towards you. And the girls are going to say, my mum just focused on the children and just had kids. So I'm just going to have kids. Fuck education, right? And she never really had a partner. She didn't look happy. She didn't go out. She didn't dress up. She didn't do nothing. She never had no hobbies. She didn't really go for things in life. Her friends were fake. I'm just going to do that. And like I said, this isn't about me slagging off anybody, but that's the truth of tarot, right? It's the truth. And that's why you're a twin flame with a flame here. Eight of wands, two of wands, ten of wands. It's a fucking burden. Taking this new life will ease you up. Going through the uh, the zero point of the full jumps in. It's the first card into tarot, right? And it's the journey, the tree of life, right? The rooted belief system, the, the growth, the stability of a tree, right? 
of um, the seasons, all of it. This is what this is. Going through that, but starting with the zero point, leaving everything you knew behind, including how your perception of this world is, tarot, and connect upstairs. I literally created this channel by connecting upstairs. And that's only because all my family dead. I had no one to talk to. And people might say, that's sad. I'm like, not really. Not if I'm really, you know, my mum up there, my dad up there, my brother up there, my auntie's up there, my sister's twin flame up there, right? I normally talk to my sister on the phone. But when I'm here, you know, you just talk to yourself and you think you're talking to yourself, but in your intuition. So it was my brother who started this because I'm very web designy, R-E, crafty. He was a web designer. So I thought, I wonder what Henry would think. That's his name, Henry. When I was doing websites and when I was doing my crafts and all my arts and things, it's like, will Henry do it? And I, and I just went like that. So like, you know, this is how I just started. Uh, what do you think? And then I got answers, right? And then my brother was connected to my mum upstairs. And then I heard my mum chatting back. And then I thought, I know it's not just my brother and my mum up there. Let me chat to the big boys. Will they chat to me? And it just went from there. And why I'm saying that, this is the truth. Do something different. The zero point is starting from new. That's why it says jumping, doing, leaving all behind. It doesn't jump in with anything, the, 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 the full card. Till ones, that's your path, right? Create your own world. Feel your world. I keep telling you this is intuition. It's to a path. It's leaving the other passion behind, right? What you think to be is your passion, but the two of ones, he's got the other ones, he's got his passion, which is what his world is supposed to be. Not the passion behind him, which is like stabbing you in the back because it's behind you, right? Which is friends, family, religion, traditions. They're not literally, but yes, of sorts. But if you go <coughs> for your passion, <coughs> excuse me, see, talking, truth, speaking, channeling, it's not channeling. I hate that word, <laughs> right? It's not hate. Hate's a strong word. But the world in your hand, you feel what you want to do in your world passionately with the other wand leads you onto your path. If not, you get burdens. It's like your path is, whoops, two of wands, your path is to connect with upstairs, connect. It's interesting. I'm doing a reading now to mission people. I do theirs once a week. And it's all about intuition. I'm going to tell them how to follow their intuition. That's what I'm going to do. Now, I tell them, I counsel mission people, mission people counsel you. So if you want to know what to do with mission people, you need to go and book them for counseling. <coughs> the five of cups is interesting. It's in the other direction. Can you see matey here? He's not facing this. And five of cups is... Dun, dun, dun. If you don't do what your truth is, not my truth, your truth. Your truth is my truth. I'm channeling for you, mate, right? which is my truth as well. You will regret it. If you go in the other direction, you will regret it. If you hold on to the third party, three of cups, trying to uh, juggling a choice, not making the choice, feeling there are choices. Two of cups in one hand. But, uh, I've put, Sophia, I've put the third party behind me. This is your person. I'm not connected with them. They're still in the fucking picture. They're still in the picture. Five of cups, right? Regret, disappointment will happen if you don't make a fucking choice of what you feel. You're holding the two cups. This is both of you, but this is mainly your masculine, right? He wants to manifest you the choices of love right and it's it's a tough choice in love but sometimes you've got to make those tough choices right and it's not really i mean for example your person's got kids normally it's kids but not all the case or whatever it is religion tradition or whatever i'll go i'll go into both so say they've got kids and it's like oh gosh if i do this then yeah with the fucking baby's mum on top of the kids right my <clears throat> if i go and tell baby's mom i love you right they don't have to do that but look you know oh 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 billy bob can you have the kids this friday right uh which pissed me off about david is like 
he'll come back and we'll, I'll say, what, what's your shift? Because he does so many shifts and they'll go, I'm off Friday. I'll go, oh, we could do something. he go, no, I'm having the kids. Normally, like I said, they're suppressing themselves. Normally, if I go out, right, and my sister's like, oh, what are you doing this weekend? What I will do is say, I'll get back to you because David might be off work and we might be doing something. They disrespect you as in a relationship as a, and they just think they can just do it like that right that's this with the kids this is like if they're manly if that, like they say they are they would say that well hold on i'll get back to you or i'll they will phone in front of you and say that do you know i would need to check on and stuff like that they just arrange it right that's control right that's not nurturing to themselves that is and that's what this is. So they're going to regret it and be disappointed and just be controlled all the time. And they say there isn't a way around it. There is nothing controlling them because if they got a solicitor, then they could have that control. If they got a solicitor for divorce, then they can have that control, right? This is them. This is self-sabotage, right? And it's the same with you. I'm not happy. I keep uh, getting ragamuffins. My job shit. I just go there for the money. It's all right. Right. You, you don't love yourself. You always think you do until obviously you do this counseling and it's like, uh, no, I don't. Right. All that kind of thing. And it's like, but what you can't get another job. Is that what you're saying? Right. You, you can't you can't follow your passions and your desires. I remember someone said something about uh, five years and this ain't going to take five years, but five years is five years. So you might as well start. And I never got it. But I, I hope you get it. It's like you think, oh, well, if it's going to take five years to change, fuck it. I'm not going to do it. But in five years, you're still going to be unhappy and older and pissed off. So you might as well do it so that in five years, there's a transformation. This ain't going to take five years. This ain't going to take. This is a yearly cycle, right? Start and jump in. And particularly if you have help, the help isn't just this community. The help is from upstairs. This is what this is about. Um, so it's about the first and last card. You follow your truth, right? You speak your truth as well. They never communicate, right? Like I said, twin flames. Oh, my person and, and all this kind of stuff. We live on planet Earth, so don't go. With, don't be fooled with the I connect with my person on the 5D. Why don't you just stay in the 5D, dead, right? Why are you on this planet? Obviously, to connect with your person on the 3D. So don't fall for that as well. Truth, clarity, right? Clarity. Can you see clarity that they're even with their person? Oh, this is my twin flame. I'm with my twin flame. I'm in union. I don't see you person. I don't see you doing mission. I don't hear you volunteering. Do you help the old fiddy diddies across the road? Do you do anything? You know, oh, I just breathe in fresh air. Do you actually do that? Do you even take the time to walk barefoot in nature and hug a tree? I bet you they don't even do that. I'll tell you what they're doing. They're just chatting to you to what to do when they don't do it themselves. And neither do you. Regret and disappointment if you don't follow your truth as a twin flame. As your person as well, the flame is for you. They know your twin flame. They know you're different. Don't fall for it. You shouldn't be talking to them about it, right? This is holding on to a false identity of stability. Holding on to what you think your path is. But this is about, um, yeah, it's covering your heart, not following your wishes and desires of the four pentacles. This is money as well. This is 3D. Pentacles, Malkuth is planet Earth, 3D way of thinking. And that's what you think your path is, but you're not happy. <sighs> both of you, both of you, both of you. There it is. Oh, I love this card. I love all my cards. <laughs> Can you see how wicked it is? It's not just the art. But anyway, sorry, it's all blurred, right? It's um, the actual what it is. You see, like I was trying to explain my Eleanor fake version of who they connected me with upstairs. Oh, there it is. Look how fucking wicked it is, right? That's who you can connect with upstairs. But they don't really look like that, to be honest with you. <coughs> no, they don't really look like that. <clears throat> 
But anyway, uh, 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 aliens connecting with alien beings. They're more like this, actually. <coughs> Teaching. You're, you're, you, like I was saying, you're a master teacher. And when I first started this community, if you don't know me, I had I attracted so many 3D Reiki experts, crystals, resin making with tower with um, pyramids and all sorts of 3D. And a tower came in and got rid of. They all went right, all all at the same time, right? Because my inner truth wasn't that. I knew it didn't work. It wasn't where I wanted to go. And I'm so glad they done it then, because if I'd done it now, I would have been one of those spiritual communities, fake ass with, yeah, just get a Reiki, book Sarah Louise for Reiki, book this one for, for um, she does some crystals, this one does, uh, you know, healing, or teaches you, let's all meet up on the retreat, it would have gone down a fake road, which wouldn't work, and I probably would have killed myself. My point is, is that because I listen to them, now I, you, I become the master teacher, which I'm teaching you to be the master teacher of how to do it from upstairs. They teach you upstairs, right? And then you're supposed to teach downstairs the correct way. Communication from downstairs. And this, look, both of these court cards are about communication. So it's about communicating clearly as well. So all those tower readers who watch me, who don't subscribe, but watch me copy my shit and go and say it on their channel and then big up that they made it up. Who cares? As long as the information's getting out there, whatever. But my point is, is that you you ask yourself, are you doing your truths as well? You ask, you look at the tarot, are they in their truths? Oh, I wouldn't put up with this. Or oh, this person's doing that. I wouldn't put up with it. Well, first of all, have you been in a situation where you're deeply in love, such as a twin flame? Then come tell me you wouldn't put up with it, you arrogant. When they're talking about get rid of this person, right? Don't stay, value yourself. I wouldn't put up with that. Shut up. If you're a twin flame, you wouldn't be saying that because you put up with, kind of put up with quite a lot. Right. So don't listen to that bunch. And then there's the other bunch that is, oh, yeah, all you got to do is hug a tree, buy, buy the pink crystal. What is it? Rose quartz crystal. Right. Archangel Raphael is helping your person. They're coming towards you, my loves. Then there's that lot. No. What kind of communication? Listen to your own communication. Don't listen to me. What's your communication telling you? Which one's correct? That's what this is about. So then you become master. Right, master teacher, what's the words? Ah, well, see, master teacher. See it there? Master the esoteric. There's the key. You know why? They're teaching you gnomes. The hidden realms, 5D, right? Energy. The hidden realms, upstairs, hidden esoteric, meaning not gnomes. So if you're listening to people who are popular and who are known, right? You're not a master teacher. It needs to be hidden knowledge. You've heard of that. The Illuminati, it, it, uh, um, all seeing eyes, are the eye from upstairs. Is it known and it's popular? I'm asking you, is it truth? Let's close this out. Sorry it's long. My video has gone up to 40 minutes again. Let's see if I get an outcome, actually. This is this is in that stage of thinking about what you're doing. There's no movement with you or your person. There's a fucking the mirror and then fucking mirror is here. Right? You're not taking the leap of faith, so they're not. You might be looking at stuff, you might be wanting to change your career and it's the same your person wants to be with you and blah 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 but there's no action here the good thing the brilliant news sorry it's long about you is that you're you're the cups we are the cups of women that's why beyonce although pretty i won't go there but women rule the world which she sings about a lot it's pretty much because we're the emotions right and this planet is emotions energy emotion right so we are here to, um, we can manipulate form easier, meaning that unfortunately, but fortunately at the same time, negative and positive, 
you have to take the leap of uh, faith first, then your person, you can manipulate that form to come towards you. This is an actual manipulation. Just gonna make that clear. It's a magician card, right? If that even make, made any sense to you. <clears throat> well, there you go. I was like, what's going on? What's going on? Look, I really do want us to work out. Look, I really do want to go to the moon. Don't mean I'm going to do it. And that's for you. I really do want to get a job. I hate it where I am. I want to I want to do something like you, Sophia. Most of you wouldn't say that, you know. But anyway, you know, but I read you. I'm like, oh, you're kind of like me. And they're like, yeah. And I'm like, well, that that that's not arrogant. That means that you can be me, right? I don't see it as like uh, anything awkward. Most of you are, are me. I'm a reflection. I'm the mirror of what you can do. So just fucking do it. Let us help you do it, right? But are you going to do it? Or are you just like, yeah, I want to be like that. And ain't that your person? I do want to be with you. I really do want us to work out. This is the clarity of what you what you're doing. Next year you to you you tell me what will be the change. All I've got to do is buy the crystal Sophia and the yoga, and then what? Your person's gonna to come towards you and you're just gonna magically get that job and that career. Do you know how many crystals got sold? And you know how many yoga are, and that um teachers are out there? Do you know how many trees out there you can hug, right? Take off your shoes and walk in the grass. If it was that easy, easy come, easy go. What's this one? I have always loved you. Past life connection, twin flame, rah, rah, rahs, right? I've always loved you. That's with that. As six of cups. This is the contract. Contract's coming out lately. I wish I could communicate. What did I fucking say? The two first, well, they're not first. Two cards about communication. I wish I could communicate how I feel. This is about feelings. Like I said, your person, right? I'm a man. I'm my own man. I do this. I do that. I'm like, no, a man is going in there and saying, what the fuck's it got to do with you, matey? What I'm doing? Who I'm dating? Where I'm going? Well, if you don't fucking do that, then I'm going to cut you off. You're not going to see kids. You're not going to see the family. Don't come here. If you're not this religion, blah, blah. I'm not your mate anymore. All right. See ya. That's the man, right? That's the same. Same with you, with your job. This isn't dissing your person. Same with you, with you, with your job. Fuck off. I'm not cleaning the toilets anymore. I'm not having you fucking talking to me like an idiot. I'm not just fucking just pouring out this juice in a bottle every day. I'm more than that. It's the same thing with you, right? Telling your children, stop taking the piss, stop taking all the money. You know, why aren't you getting a job? Teaching them boundaries. Not your person teaching your children. That's that, right? Communicate. Right. And the communication is from upstairs. It's like, you know what you need to do or what wants to be done is communicating to you. The next step is taking the action. I promise you, if you don't take the action, they ain't going to take the action. And right. If you take the action and they don't take the action, who gives a shit? Because. Say you want to be that singer and you take the action, you're going to be famous and out there anyway. You probably meet Brad Pitt. So you don't really care if they're going to stay because they will stay there. Both of you, it won't change. I think that's the wake up call that's coming in now. If you don't make the changes, it won't change, right? If you want to delude yourself that, oh, I'm just going to manipulate this person or this job or whatever, and that's going to blow up. You know it's not going to work. This double world, two of pentacles, right? It's not going to work. Make a choice. If not, two of cups. Choose the love that you feel and you want to manifest. And sort the third party. If not, you'll be in regret. Last card. All right, I'm going to leave it there. Sorry, it's long. Book us, right? Everything's in the description box or the website, right? <clears throat> Speak to you later.